Alright, uh, ladies and gents, welcome to another unboxing video. Um, today we're going to unbox the ZD Toys Iron Man Mark V. So, this is the fifth, ob obviously, the fifth in the series of Tony Stark's um, suit of armors. A um, little bit of detail on this the Mark V Iron Man armor is also known as a suitcase suit. This was Tony Stark's fifth Iron Man suit. It's also the first one to use uh, to specialize on uh, portability and easy access. It was first used by Tony Stark during the duel of Monaco um, versus uh, Whip uh, Whiplash. Uh, that scene where uh, he was like racing in an F1 and um, Mickey Ward comes along and. Uh, happy delivers him the suitcase so yeah this is it this is the suit all right so let's go ahead and do a quick unboxing all right first we take it off uh, the plastic wrap so be really careful with it I don't want to nick the pristine condition of the box. Right. And there you go. A close look at the box. That glossy slash metallic red uh, there. Iron Man Mark V posing there Iron Man Mark V at the back photos um, showcasing his posability this, these were actually like the poses that he made um, in that movie and this is the suit in its um, suitcase mode Iron Man Mark V and of course the Disney logo right there so not a bootleg not a KO this is a licensed product by Marvel and Disney all right so let's go ahead and take a look at the inside of the box shall we all right so on with the unboxing um, I always like how ZD Toys um, set up this box. It's a magnetic and it always showcases or highlights the arc reactor right smack in the, in the middle of um, the two flaps here. Alright, so let's open it up and <laughs> it's actually is like that. It's uh, you're gonna see the Mark 5 photo on there like the tech details and the photo is just freaking awesome so it has a flap you just put this aside here and right there you can see the bad boy right away wow all right so let's see what he actually comes with so this is the first uh, layer Mark V itself with um, the suitcase and at the bottom part uh, are the extra pair of hands um, what you call this uh, the, the blasts for his uh, hands and feet all right Let's take a closer look at the accessories and later on the unit, shall we? Okay, so a closer look at the accessories. We got four repulsor blasts. Two for the hands, two for the feet. We got our arm here for posing him if you want to make him look like flying so this is, uh, frick uh, I kind of like 
the spring-loaded ones more than this like non spring loaded they're just like ugh, I don't feel so good <laughs> about them uh, of course the stand yeah Iron Man Mark 2 Mark 5 oh, right there if you can see it there you go uh, the hands okay let's take a look at the hands two hands here open palm and these are the ones that have uh, holes in them so you can peg the repulsor blasts like so it's gonna look like that okay and other set of hands with painted repulsor details on there Let's see if I can zoom in uh, there you go and another set of hands wow just take a closer look at at the details on, on the tech details on this hand there like you can see between the fingertips the tech details like ZD Toys always like dives into the details of each Iron Man item that they make I, I also wish they make other line items but more Iron Man please all right so we're about to get to the exciting part um, the actual unit itself mark 5 And there we have him standing just plain and simple under the box under the light inside the box rather so yeah just marvel at the details of how ZD Toys once again created another perfect Iron Man 10th scale one is the 10th scale um, figure seven inch figure so in a bit we're gonna take a closer look and up close um, inspection shall we say of um, the, the paint job uh, articulation and all that all right can't wait to get a hold of this guy up close and see and feel how he actually is on hand let's see all right so here we go let's take a closer look at Iron Man Mark 5 and his um, suitcase all right so taking a closer look at it I mean wow like the likeness of it um, with the one that was in the movies just freaking spot on I, I always love um, how the red cherry red hot rod ish color pops out and like it doesn't matter what combination you come up with it you can combine it with gold or with gunmetal with black and like it's always always like perfect for some odd reason so like whoever thought of the color scheme for Iron Man really freaking nailed it all right so let's move on to mark 5 itself looking at the uh, colors uh, the color scheme on this bad boy uh, I mean, like I said a couple of seconds ago, it doesn't matter what color you pair up this hot cherry rod, uh, cherry hot rod with, it just always looks awesome. And like so far out of the um, Mark series, this 
um, Mark V actually um, sports um, the most gunmetal as far as color schemes are concerned. Uh, like the tech details on how ZD Toys painted this guy is like awesome. It's just it's always like an experience unboxing um Z D Toys Iron Man. Uh wow. Alright, so let's move along and go with the uh articulation the head all right <laughs> spins 360 not bad um, okay as far as the head movement goes it nods and it he can look up a little a bit uh, side to side not so much going down to the torso or going down to the shoulder of course it's uh, pop out as always and yep that flapping um, shoulder pad there always cool to have that feature added on to each model uh, 360 movement on the shoulders or arms uh, of course I'm gonna assume it's double jointed which is always double jointed yep double jointed and the other elbow double jointed I'm not so sure but this can kind of the joints of mark 5 kind of feel the softest compared to all the previous mark models that I have unboxed so far torso I'm pretty sure this one pops up yep uh, it gives you a little bit of um, ab crunch there and a little bit of tilt upward kind of looks taller if you pop this out like maybe a couple of centimeters and allows you for a uh, wider range of motion uh, the thighs or the legs pop out also for wider range of motion so if popped in it's just gonna be like that but if you pop it out it's gonna be like this so a little bit wider as far as posing purposes are concerned uh, also ball joint fists double jointed knees more than 90 degree bend as always for ZD toys ball joint feet as well all right so I think that would actually wrap it up it's just a very quick unboxing um, video for the mark 5 so I still got like two more Iron Man <laughs> boxed up waiting to be unveiled on my channel uh, all right so that being said um, keep safe and see you on my next unboxing video folks peace